Hey, welcome to the stream. I hope this works well. I'm just running some tests and then I will resume the stream. If it's fucking working at all. Right, I don't know if it's working. It seems to be working. I wasn't expecting that. Well, I'm gonna start the stream in a second. Oh no, there seems to be quite a bit of lag for some reason between my live and what I can hear back in the stream. It seems that the stream is very delayed, but nonetheless, it is intact and functioning well. So we're gonna start the stream in a second, guys. Stay tuned. And we're going to resume our game and see if Mother Rama has had indeed this change of heart. Right, I hope that uh, you can hear me well and I hope that my voice is not chopped up now. I have just, I needed to put a fan next to me because it's so warm these days. I really needed something to keep me fresh. I hope that the voice, I hope that the noise of the fan is not bleeding into the mic and that you can hear me well nonetheless. So the story is that I have now defeated uh, Mother Rame and we're only left to see whether he has had indeed his change of heart. We're expecting him to become good and confess his sins and confess his crimes and atone and just, you know, have some sort of um, public change of heart. Right. Who's this guy? Is he sleeping? Whoa, this guy's sleeping. What's he doing there? What's this story with Japanese people sleeping at school? 
I find it incredibly unhealthy. I mean, I used to do it all the time, but I don't know. It's just strange of them. Sorry, I sound really bad, but... Did you forget? We need to look into the truth behind the housekeeping service. We did look into the housekeeping service and we found out that one of our teachers were providing, um, you know, she in particular was providing certain services. I'm not going to go into further details, but she was working as a maid and apparently, yeah, that's the job. Honestly. But perhaps the job was entailing something. Let's hear something. Perhaps that's... Perhaps we will learn a bit more about that background or the background of that by eavesdropping on this conversation. Like my hair is a mess. Mrs. Kawakami, I already know. Kawakami's been driven into a corner by Chono. Let's talk to her so we can help her out. <sighs> As I've been saying, get them safely. Well, then I have another matter to attend to, so I have to excuse myself. No, we're not finished talking yet. Uh, Bye. so... There's been a series of scandals on this campus. We're all being called into question. And yet you live work earlier than anyone. And you barely make it to the faculty meetings. Explain yourself. Don't tell me you're running around at night. Kawakami is being grilled by Chono. The harp. She says she would do anything if we helped her out. So let's clear up Chono's suspicions. The school is closing soon, Mr. Fumboot. I don't know before it gets late. Or did you need something from Mrs. Kawakami? I have a question for her. What? What? Uh, you, you have another question? Another question? Oh, that's right. Uh, Fumbut's questions are complicated, so I take time at night to help him. So you're giving individual lessons outside of school hours? What passion? You are the ideal teacher. A passionate teacher is exactly what we need at this school. Oh, it seems that we really turned around the opinion that she was starting to have about Mrs. Kawakami. Hmm. She just kind of convinced herself. But that did clear up her suspicion, so thanks. Could you come with me for a bit? I can't talk about this at school. This is the address and phone number of my night job. I received the phone number from Kawakami. Oh my god, if other school pupils saw this, they would start a rumor. Call a night and request me. Just be careful that it doesn't show up in your call history though, okay? No call history means a public telephone. Let's call from LeBlanc's yellow phone. Really? Let's call her over to your room the next time you're free at night. Oh my god. What do we call her for? Is this what I think it is? Maid servicing? I like their umbrellas. Hmm? I like that because it's raining today. The school pupils are wearing holding umbrellas. It's a nice touch. She's still jealous, as usual. Mm -hmm. And it's a Saturday, so there is much to do. I could go talk to my friend here, Yuji, see if I can level up with him. What's up? I'm really not digging all this sitting around crap. Dude, I really want to talk. Or guess more like vent. I feel like I can become closer. Okay, then if it means becoming closer to him, then let's do it and let's spend some time with him. I don't remember any other commitments anyway. And we have done with Kamoshida, so I'm sorry, Madarame, so it's fine. Let's hang out with him. It's kind of far, but it's totally worth it. The flavor is out of this world. Alright. Wanna get going? Ogikubo. Let's take the train over there. Oh, we have a new location. That's so cool. A quiet and convenient residential district with famous frame and shop. 
lip smacking agreement. The new flavor of old style soy broth isn't worth the long wait in line. Oh, I adore this part of, you know, traveling inside in game scenarios. You now have information on a new hangout spot. You can also invite people who may enjoy eating ramen to hang out with you there. Ah, I love the feeling of noodles sliding down my throat. Sweat dripping over my face. She's best ramen is life. Light soup like this really gets your, your body going again after a good run, you know? We used to come all the way out here after practice and he's reminiscing. I guess that's all in the past. He's being nostalgic. <sighs> By the way, I've seen Nakaoka around a few times. But for some reason, it don't look like it's getting along with the others. Uh, who's Nakaoka? A guy from the track team, X track team. I've been thinking about what he said though, how the whole track team was putting up with Kamoshida's shit. And now I have to dub for all of them. I think he was right. They don't even got a club room anymore. So they've been storing all their stuff behind the gym. They can't use any school gear. They ain't really a place for outcasts like that. I should know that better than anyone, so this, the team has been reduced to simply a bunch of guys running around the school. It's good they're keeping their heads low now though. I don't want them ending up like this, like me. Well, I know how you feel, I'm an outcast myself. We're both outcasts here, yeah? It's probably tough just walking around school for you with all the rumors and shit. We really don't belong anywhere. But you know, maybe that ain't so bad after all. That's true guys, you got company. I guess now that I'm thinking about it, trying to fit in is a real pain in the ass. I mean, I would never have met you guys in, if I wasn't an outcast, right? So, it's all good. <laughs> For real though, it's been a shit of fun. Hanging out with you guys is freaking cool. Why does he have to swear so much? But the bond is going growing deeper. Punk talk! We have learned a new ability and we've reached rank 4, the new ability punk talk. Chance to step in after shadow. Okay, okay. That's cool. I think that another person I had a... Uh, maybe it was Anne. Anne has got the similar, a similar ability now. She can jump in after a negotiation fails and try to, you know, save the situation and make the negotiation successful in the end. All right. Cool. Hmm. We still got to find a new spot for our training. I'll think about it. No slack enough till then, okay? See ya. It seems that Ryuji is somehow trying to find redemption for his problems at school with the track team. Who knows, perhaps later in the game we will find a way to make rights with the team. Ah, you're back. The exhibition ends more. Madarama must have had his change of art by now, right? I'm sure we'll be fine. So far nobody's come charging us with anything, yeah? But wouldn't he wait to press charges until after the exhibition? What should we do if someone contacts us about it tomorrow? Try asking Yusuke, he's still staying with Madarama, right? I was right, where is Yusuke? I wonder if he'll be okay with Madarama, so I'm late to contact you all. It seems something will certainly be happening tomorrow. Madarama is on the phone as we speak. What do you mean something? I believe he is preparing for a media announcement. I didn't hear anything about pressing charges. Guess we just gotta wait then. Let us meet in Shibuya tomorrow. See you then. The exhibition is finally ending tomorrow. I'm sure things will work out fine this time. Hey! Didn't Kawakami give you her phone number? You gonna call her? 
I don't know, I would like to spend some time with Sojigo too. But first, let's see if I can learn some if I can learn something from TV show. Featherhawk has regained his lost memories. But now a new villain has revealed himself. The earth shattering appearance of a new leader revive and fight Phoenix Rangers. Okay, the Power Rangers are on TV tonight. So you know what? It may be a good idea to spend some time with him. Can become closer with Shoji or thanks to the hero friend Persona Barrett. I don't think my bond with Shoji will deepen just yet. Yeah. You know what? I still want to help him out. Because I want to push it a bit quicker. I want to check out this story. I want to learn about him. And I don't care about that teacher. She's up to no good, I guess. Alright then. Plus, coffee is important to me. I want to learn how to make it good. So, Jew's guidance is extremely precise. Is it just as he told me? I did, just as he told me. I don't think my bond with Sojigo will deepen just yet. Well, it seems that this was a bit of a waste of a Saturday night. But nonetheless, it was necessary to give it a shot. What's up with that old geezer? What's up with that old geezer? Oh. Is he crying? Oh my god, it's actually happening. Mother Rama seems to be down and broken. I have committed I crimes. Have committed crimes that are unbecoming of an artist. Plainly put, I plagiarized work. He's confessing. It's happening. I... I tainted this... This country's art world! And, and even Sayori! How could I... I possibly apologize to... To everyone for... For what I've done! <laughs> He's crying way too much. <laughs> and that was from the urgent apology conference by Matarame that took place just a moment ago. That's right, I even got the trophy for that. Welcome to the stream. Hello Jay, welcome everyone. Yeah, you just saw it live. Matarame just got a change of art and apologized publicly. In the most, uh, what can I say? Well, in the most dramatic way possible. After reporting to the association, Matarame has agreed to the police's request to turn himself in. Wasn't he on TV the other day? On top of charges of abuse to his pupils, Matarame is under suspicion of claiming their works as his own. Some doubt the validity that his maiden work Sayuri was stolen, believing it was used for fraud. This large-scale criminal act has caused a great shock to the art world, and... That old man's done for. He is. After the conference, Matarame was taken to a police hospital for interrogation due to his age. That's right. However, initial psych evaluations state that he is mentally sound and likely responsible for his actions. Yep. There's no need to be nice to an old geezer like that. Okay, now. Don't kick them when they're down. Why do he spill the beans himself? Doesn't that seem weird? Also, a group calling themselves the Phantom Thieves posted a dubious note at Matarame's exhibit. The police will investigate their relation to this case, but for now, did not identify them as suspects. Phantom thieves? Do these bandits have something to do with that old geezer's apology? All right. Oh, I've heard of them before. They supposedly steal evil hearts. It's why the culprits apologize. Wait, what? Steal hearts? <laughs> That's impossible, though. 
But I feel like I saw something about that online, too. They sent out a calling card for real. Oh, so it was like, we're going to take your heart? Oh, that's impressive if someone really did that. And we did. Oh, yeah. Phantom thieves, huh? Pleasant boy. Phantom thieves, huh? <laughs> what do they mean by pleasant boy? Pleasant? Hmm. Would they mean good looking or something like that? Phantom thieves again. Oh, she's the one from school that is trying to investigate. Oh no, wait, she's the investigator herself. She's the prosecutor, isn't she? Or is she the sister of the prosecutor? She's the sister of the you prosecutor. see the news about Madarame? It's just like what happened with Kamoshida. Yeah. And they mentioned the Phantom Thieves. Yep, we're famous. And you look different today. She, she changed clothes because it's Sunday. That's right, they look different because it's Sunday. Oh, I love that little touch. Man, this is starting to get interesting. If we do it right, we can change people's hearts. With this power, we might be able to do more than just getting back at society. It'll be a big deal. Yeah, Gigi, I don't like your enthusiasm and your ambitions. It doesn't look like you're doing it for the right thing. Man, you're so indifferent. Then again, doesn't that make him more trustworthy as our leader? Thank you. As for me, I hope we just keep getting more and more famous. No, there you go. You see? You see? That's why I don't like you. Something like this happening twice is massive, too. It's too great a coincidence to occur normally. If we continue doing this, we'll definitely be able to give courage to everyone who needs it. We may want to quiet down a little. Do you know them? You moron! Those are attendance officers! Hello there. May I speak with you for a moment? Hmm. <clears throat> Uh-oh. Ah, yes! How can we help you? That monotonous acting of hers never fails to send a chill down my spine. Yeah. What are you all doing here? Are you friends? We're delinquents. Hmm? What did you say? Uh, <laughs> th that was a joke! <laughs> he didn't get much sleep last night. Well, alright. Just make sure you disperse before it gets too late, okay? Hey. How oh, there you. I'm gonna stay put. There's a lot of happenings lately, and the news about that artist has caused quite the stir. We'll be careful. The light out. Man, those guys must have way too much time on their hands. Hey, don't go making stuff up on the spot like that, okay? I totally panicked because of you. Yeah, that wasn't too cool of me. From now on, we'll need to be even more cautious than before. Look at us. Right after the second thieves incident, both prior victims are meeting up. Right after the second thief's incident, both prior victims are meeting up. Yeah. Wait, you mean people might be listening to us? It'll be fine. Look around, we're the only people worrying about it. I guess you're right. By the way, Yusuke, you able to get anything out of Madarame? Remember how he was talking about that suspicious person in the black mask? Oh yeah, what about that? Well, I pressed him for answers, but he doesn't even understand what happened to him to begin with. It's not like he actually saw his desires get stolen, after all. It's rumored that he may be sent to prison. 
In that case, gaining information will be difficult. So, what are you gonna do now? I'll be leaving that house. I can't draw in such a place anymore. Do you have somewhere to go? The school dorms. I can stay there free of charge thanks to my fine arts scholarship. Lucky you. A scholarship? Wait, you're that good? Although, Takamaki-san's house would do as well. <laughs> Wait, what? I bet. You know, you could ask her to model for you whenever you wanted. You moron! Then again, now that Yusuke will be living alone, it'll be easier for us to meet up whenever we want. For the time being, we should wait and see how this case plays out. <sighs> and it'll probably take some time finding a target as big as Madarame. Yeah. Anyway, we should just act like normal students while we look for our next target, okay? We'll be entrusting that to you again, Ryuji. All right. Guess it's just more prep till then. Yep. Uh oh. Yusuke Kitagawa. Yeah. It looks like I felt like I was being observed. And there we are. We are fast forwarding into the past. Back to the past, I suppose. Back to the interrogation room. So after Shiho Suzui, you did it again for someone you barely knew? Who is Shio? Ah, Shio Suzui is the girl from school. So after Shio Suzui, you did it again to avenge someone you barely knew. You were sent away twice, almost reported to the police, and yet you still wanted to save him. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Moreover, you ended up in a museum instead of a castle this time. You're still going to maintain this rubbish about changing someone's heart by stealing their treasure? What do you want? What do you want me to say? It's all true. Let's stand by it. Very well. The truth behind this tale of yours will be clear once your conspirators are in custody. Now then, tell me about this new member who joined your group. A new member? There's no point in being stubborn. It will only damage your position. The identity of Madarame's pupil can be easily discovered with a little investigation. Yeah, go right ahead. So you won't sell out your accomplice? <sighs> Fine. There's still much more that I want to hear. It was around this time that the Phantom Thieves began to truly gain popularity. Alright. Lies flooded the internet. Things like the Phantom Thieves saved me too, or I got a calling card. Oh no. For heaven's sake, those lies made the collection of intel take almost ten times longer. Oh, that's kind of good. Now your next target was this man. What, what, what? Junya Kaneshiro. He looks mafia. He doesn't compare to the previous two. Even the police had been struggling to apprehend him. So... Exactly how did you take down such a well-guarded criminal? Tell me. Whoa. This big guy is our next target? He seems to be like a full-on mafia guy. The summary of the story up to this point has been updated. Oh, we should read it sometimes. Maybe next time. To read, press the triangle button, open the menu, then select story from under the system option.
Welcome to the stream. Has repeatedly testified that he does not have any recollection of his actions. A full psychiatric evaluation will be performed to further investigate the crime's details and motives. It seems that this is Sai, the prosecutor, and the guy on the left must be the top guy of the Japanese police department or whatever it is. First Kamoshida at Shujin Academy, and now Matarame. I know, I know. I, I hope you guys enjoy my voice coming from the left side. It's my signature setup and I'm sure it does for a very satisfying um, view. Enjoy. I found a number of points of commonality between the two. Both, for example, were sent a calling card before their unforeseen changes of heart. I see. SIU director. We still don't know his name. But isn't tying their cases to the series of psychotic breakdowns jumping to conclusions? Unless any of you can read the kanjis on his desk. Furthermore, the police will frown upon you stepping into this. Yes, this is my first playthrough, guys. And, you know, I'm taking it easy, going very slow. I'm about 35 hours in, but this was only the second boss that I've just defeated in my previous stream. And, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Now isn't the time to be worrying about things like jurisdiction and honor. No, it's not. We need to dig deeper and find a correlation among the incidents these past two, three years. He's trying to be the proper prosecutor, trying to, you know, collect data and find evidences. Very well, I leave it to you. However, you must not let this interfere with your regular duties. Thank you, sir. Hey, good luck with the final boss there. That damn woman just had to stick her nose into this. Oh. You know, the way he said this, the way he said the damn woman just had to stick her nose into this, it does look as if he knew something and as if he knows something else. Something that he's keeping from her. And I understand that these abnormal incidents have caused some anxiety throughout our country. This situation must be approached with the utmost seriousness. This guy. I remember this guy from the... from the elevator. It was some sort of politician that showed up at the... at the buffet. And he was being forceful and forced his way. I uh, sort of jumped the queue and got into the elevator and pushed us out or something like that. I shall continue to put forth great effort so that every citizen can live with peace of mind. Not only are there these phantom thieves to worry about, but if that is exposed... is exposed was he referring to anyway yeah I suspect this game is probably gonna take me over 120 hours hey. if I remember correctly you were you transfer lines at Shibuya right I heard a customer say it's gotten pretty dangerous over there don't let yourself be a tug got it yeah this is gonna be a long game in Persona 4 I sank about 120 hours into that and Persona 5 I clocked in about 50-60 hours and I was I was far away from the from the from the end of the game you have my gratitude why are you so polite for all of a sudden I truly am thankful to you for making me come to my senses yours one is so bad like, who would say such a thing? You're exaggerating. I oh, certainly am not. I must express my gratitude earnestly. 
You're one of us now, man. We'll be counting on you, okay? Of course. And if anything comes up, we want his detail in the hand, okay? Oh my god, this this conversation was so cheesy. I think it only made sense in Japanese. And I really struggled to make an actual translation for it. Well, there were a lot of ups and downs, but we still pulled off our first job. Yusuke joined the team too, so let's continue reforming society like this. This whole theme of reforming society sort of reminds me of Death Note, the anime. Yeah, the bold guy, I think he also is the, you know, the bold politician. I think he also is the guy that was assaulting the woman and I intervened and then he sued me and now I'm in Tokyo. I think he's the guy that was behind all that. So I look forward to having a final showdown with him at some point. Hey. And now, news from artist Ichigi Usai, Madarama's Prince Conference. He has admitted to selling copies of his famous painting Sayuri. Police intend to thoroughly investigate Mr. Madarama for fraud. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, why don't we go out? Oh, I could actually go out. What do we do the, this evening? Sunday night. I've never been to the bath. Where's the bath? Somewhere around here. Disgraceful. Oh my. I can't do this. Let's try to go. I'm, I've just never been, so it'd be nice to go. Use the bathhouse, I think I'll come out with a bit more charm than I had before. Oh. Let's go take a bath and refresh ourselves. Hey, you know what? I don't know if it's a good time to go Sunday night or not, but whatever, let's just try it out because I've never been. Hey chat, don't don't spoiler me anything, please. Please don't spoiler me stuff. Mm. My body's warming up. I suspect there will be multiple endings indeed, I suspected that. It seems like you really refreshed yourself. I think you're even more handsome now. In Persona 4 Golden, I finished the game once and then I finished the game with the true ending. When you actually apprehend the, the true criminal and then, you know, you get the whole thing done. I think you're even more handsome now. Hmm. Thank you, cat. That wasn't creepy at all. I am level 2. I'm level head turning. Well, that's nice. I'm still pretty bad at guts. I only am level 1. I should really work on my guts. Right. Your charm has increased to head turning. One head Come on, we should get home before you get cold. Yeah, especially if you stay like that. I don't like Ryuji in my party. I keep saying this, but Yuji seems to be a bit off. There's something about him that makes him come across as a bit jealous or something. Hey, look at my popularity gauge there. I'm 16% popular. That is a lot. I used to be 6. That is a big bump. It seems that the Mother Rame thing has really blown up. That's a calling card for the Phantom Thieves, right? The way it's written seems pretty legit. Have they really stolen people's hearts? I can't believe the Phantom Thieves actually exist. Yeah. Morning! The response to Mother Rama's press conference was huge. Everyone's talking about the calling card. Girls are checking me out today. Maybe they can't help but sense my overflowing Phantom Thieves charisma. Or maybe it's all in your mind. Am I finally starting to be popular with all the flying? Oh, oh no! What's wrong? 
Isn't that what you always wanted? For real? My uniform, man, that's why. We're supposed to switch to summer uniforms today. I knew people would look at me. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> All right. Such a fail. <laughs> Holy shit, you're pale. Your sleeves are not so, uh, so not for you. Shut up, kids. Did you catch the news yesterday anyway? Watching that famous artist cry eyes out over all the artworks he's stolen. The same thing happened to Kamoshida, right? But got weird calling cards too. If you ask me, the same person is behind all this. The news this morning said a group called the Front Boots are the ones behind the cards. I wonder how to get people to confess. I mean, they can't literally be stealing hearts. Because that would entail surgery. Blackmail, maybe? How are things going in regard to that matter we spoke of earlier? Why don't you just mention it again? I have nothing to report yet. So Makoto is the sister, that, this is important. Makoto happens to be the sister, the younger sister of Sai, the investigator, the prosecutor that we have just seen earlier in the interrogation room. I'm still to understand what sort of relationship they have and how she will lead the Phantom Thieves to her or the other way around. Nothing at all? How many students are there who could provoke a teacher? I've already narrowed it down. I just can't get any solid evidence. <sighs> you knew, didn't you? About Mr. Kamashita sexually harassing students. Sir! What will come of you asking that? Oh my god, you're such a scumbag. This investigation is for a just cause, correct? I believe I understand how flustered this must be making you. I'm sure it was truly shocking for you as student council president to see a peer attempt suicide. Yes. We must provide a school environment where all students can feel at ease. Why are you giving me that? That is the most pressing issue we have to tackle at the moment. So that's your reason behind this investigation on the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? We don't even know if they truly exist. Why are you... You heard about the incident with that Madarami fellow, I assume? Hmm, the principal is also pulling his own strings here. They said there was a similar calling card to the one used in Mr. Komashita's case. I wish to believe that this is unrelated to our students. Yes. That is where I stand. I suggest you devote your energy to the task at hand, not unnecessary questions. Matarame's press conference. You mean that guy who was all like, how could I possibly apologize for what I've done? Ah. <laughs> I like his impression. Think it was really those phantom thieves? You know, the whole stealing your heart thing? Look at the look at the drawing on the blackboard behind. That? Uh, there's no way. But then again. It seems too convenient for it all to just be coincidence. Yeah! How's it going? Have you found our next big target? I like his t-shirt. I like the t-shirt, no more rule. Oh my god, I want that t-shirt now. Please. Is anybody selling that t-shirt, no more rule? started looking yesterday no way I'm gonna find one that quick Yuji calm down please oh yeah I guess that's true by the way I decided on the TV station what about you two huh 
Oh, crap, the social studies trip. Oh, I just want to ditch it. You'd better go to your school activities. Didn't I tell you not to draw attention to yourselves? Wouldn't me suddenly turn it into a good student stand out more? He has a point. Quit bickering and go. Then let's all choose the TV station. Yeah, so we can all hang out and draw even more suspicions. I heard we're gonna get to watch them tape a show. Maybe there'll be actresses there. You got my attention. Oh well, not like I got anything better to do than waiting for info to come in online. Plus, Morgana's right. Showing up will keep the teachers from getting all suspicious of me. All right, I'm gonna head back. TV, huh? Maybe I should get a haircut. That guy is such an idiot. I hope nothing happens. Stupidity scares me. Hello there, welcome. Good to see you, man. Welcome to the stream, everyone. It feels pretty great having everyone talking about us, huh? Wonderama is the only topic of conversation in my school. It's the only topic of conversation. And as am I, and as am I, so is, and as am I, is poo -poo, most of my peers have chosen to ignore me. For real, that's bullshit. Are you gonna go be okay? There is no need to worry. They had already been treating me differently from others as it stood. There's nothing new to me. Okay then. More importantly, do we have any leads on our next mission? You kidding? There's no way we'd find a target that quick. To Mementos we go, I don't know, I'm not even that sure about Mementos for now. Although, probably, now that we have this new popularity, if we get to the mementos now, we will probably do some more damage there. So... But I wanna focus on social skills for now. Yeah, we could always go to mementos. I'll keep myself free. Now then. Let's just lay low for a while, so keep your head down, okay? Oh my god, this phone. I found some great intel. This time it's pulling by a Cosé student they call a Queen. She's been ordering around a male student who goes by the name M. Kinda like the M in s and I wish I was in his shoes. Does M stand for Mishima? <laughs> no, let's take it seriously. Let's go with That's Horrible. It makes you want to cry, doesn't it? Anyway, here are the details. This girl acting like a queen is Hikari Shimizu. I wonder if it's more likely that the girl will turn out like that if she has an ass as an initial. Well, I already posted the warning, so you should take it on when you have the time. Hopefully you don't end up an M. Hey, hey! <laughs> Morgana doesn't really... Morgana is not very familiar with the S&M and uh, nomenclature. Hey Misa, no worries. I will make this available online as part of the playlist as usual. I hope you still have the link. Mm. It's raining, yeah? The way weather affects people here may affect mementos too. Yeah, but I don't care about mementos. I care about listening about what school kids are saying. Mm -hmm. I heard Mother Rama was in the calling card. It's just like what happened to Mr. Kamoshida. You think maybe the Phantom Thieves go to our school? That'd be exciting, wouldn't it? That's great and all, but I'm more excited to buy something else. Our field trip is coming up, and I want to go see the TV station. It's almost the rainy season, but the constant rain bumps me out and I don't want to do anything. What are you talking about? The rainy season is the time to buy limited rainy day goods. In fact, there is a limited time drizzle natto that sold at Shibuya Station's underground level. Wow, you really know so much about special. 
Okay, it's at sh so it's at Shibuya Station on the Grand Mall. Okay, you know what, guys? I think I'm going to Shibuya Station on the Grand Mall. Hey, thanks for subscribing. All support is always appreciated. And uh, let's see what these guys are saying. First time I received the calling card, this pranks are really freaking me out. Oh yeah, when I looked up the Phantom Thieves online, I found this weird blog by a crazy person. Her blog is called The Phantom Thieves Want to Steal My Boyfriend. She mentions bloodstorms a lot. Oh, she really sounds deranged. I feel bad for her boyfriend, whoever he is. Perhaps it's her. Mm -hmm. She mentioned bloodstorms. What a relief. Looks like that home wrecking tramp is in around here. After the artist, though, those phantom thieves might come back to steal Keguzi Kun's art. If they come, I'll show them no mercy. It'll be a bloodstorm. Oh my god, it's gonna be. It's her. It's her. Oh, look at that. Look at that. The school teacher. Oh, you're still here. Would have Sakumoto kun and Takamaki san been insane about the shocking Madarama case? Never mind, I was simply curious. She's totally investigating on us. Totally. Tell you what, guys. I want to go buy the thing from Shibuya. But there are other activities that I could do. <sighs> like for instance the library. No, I'm curious about the Nato special now. Underground mall. I'm not gonna spend that much money on gifts now. Not really what I'm here for. Part is closed. Underground walkway, not. N is here. I kind of want to spend time with her, but first I want to buy the netto thing. Come in. I don't know if I should buy buy nutrients. Don't think it's that important, right? Yeah. I can always come back. Up, huh? Shoe repair shop. Jewelry store. Where's the Nato shop? Please, take your time. Are you an idiot? So record shop here. Let me try this in record shop just in case. Welcome. Classical hits. I'll buy it. You know what? Why am I buying this? Like, there's really no reason for me to buy this. 3,000 yen. It's kind of cheap, but still. Why Why buy it? I'm sorry. I just got excited by the fact that it was on sale. Welcome! There you go. Drizzle Natto. Restore 80 HP to all allies, but it's 1,300. Well, fair enough. I can only buy one. Oh my god, all this work for nothing. Uji Matcha Flan. Uji Matcha Flan? You know what? I'll, I'll buy it just. I bought the cheapest gift that you can buy around here. ID Photo Boot. It seems to have lots of function to make people look better in their pictures, but it's a certification for the machine, right? This picture shouldn't be manipulated. Manipulated, sorry, well, what am I saying? Nothing up there. 
Let's go down there. Let's see where it brings us. All right, all right. I am lost again, just like in real Shibuya. I don't, I don't know where I am. What is this place? Feel free to buy anything you like. Welcome. Um, don't know, don't know. What, what, what's there? There's nothing. There's nothing you need to do here. Let's go somewhere else. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I heard. How about? Okay, I can go through here. Hey, who's there? Hello. Ah, Andrea. The station is always full of people. It serves as the perfect spot for people watching. By the way, do you have any business here? I came to see you, which is not true, but... <laughs> you must have a wealth of free time if that is your decision. After what happened with Mother Rame, I have come to realize the two-faced, complex nature of mankind. People are difficult to handle and makes for an interesting team. This is why I intend on people watching here for quite some time. What? Good luck people watching. Oh. Seems like a legit activity. Really? I should come back here on Sunday. Yeah, I heard. Awesome. What are your thoughts? Any good jobs? The flower shop for charming people. Not my priority right now. You know what? Let's try and spend time with her. With N. Let's see. There is a little uh, card on top of her. Perhaps this will work. Hiya. Are you here to shop today too? Oh, yeah. Do you want to go somewhere? I don't think my bond with N with will deepen. Okay. Fortunately not. Don't forget it. Oh, that's too bad. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do something else. It's simple as that. Perhaps I can go to the to the diner and study there. <laughs> if I study here, I might be able to gain more knowledge. Nice. It might be empty since it's raining today. Yep, let's go in. Let's see if this is actually beneficial to us on a rainy day. Oh. The rain's keeping the customers away. May I take your order? Give me the nostalgic steak. steak. Just like grandma made it. I feel rich. I've got a budget for it, let's spend it. Mm. That's a lot to stack on while you're studying the proportions. Definitely grand. Nice. You sure look happy. Did you savor the taste of grandma's kindness? Mm hmm. Cool. I improved my kindness. All right. Hey. My studying went well. Did I get any special perks for the fact that it's raining outside? All right. Nice. I think you really were able to study since it wasn't that busy, huh? Oh yes, you see? I got extra points for studying on a rainy, non-busy moment. All right. Wanna head back? I was in Japan for just a week. This was a couple of years ago. But I stayed in in Tokyo and visited Shibuya extensively as well at Shinjuku and all the area where the Yakuza games are set. I'm a big fan of Yakuza game so I visited that area quite a lot and this game really captures I think the certain scenarios in Japan and it's also based on an actual neighborhood. If you look it up online I think I posted something about this on my Twitter some time ago. Uh, there are comparison websites where you can see the difference between Persona 5 or Yakuza games and the actual in real life uh, location. You haven't heard anything from the student council president, have you? 
Miss Honor Student must be busy kissing ass somewhere. You don't have to be so harsh. What is this about the student council president? The one at our school has kind of been keeping tabs on us. I think she's suspicious of us. Are you sure it is not merely a result of Ryuji's general misconduct? Shut up! Though, to be honest, the three of you most certainly stand out. Do try to be careful. I cannot be there to look over you at school, you know? The duty rests on your broad shoulders, Andrea. Okay. Don't worry. I'll make sure to keep an eye on Ryuji too. Why do you gotta single me out like that? Okay. The other... The others kind of overshadow you sometimes, but don't forget, you're famous too. Just make sure you're careful, okay? I don't care. Truly don't care. Let's talk to this guy. You got time right now? I feel like I'm becoming closer. Okay, finally, after having spent an evening prior to this with him, it seems that I've gotten to the point where I can extend it a bit more. Let's see. Oh, it seems that I, my bond won't, won't, won't deepen with him just yet. You know what? Fuck. No, I don't want to. I'm curious. I want to. I do want to spend time with him. But you know what? It seems a good, like a good night to you call the the maid teacher. There is a teacher. We found out in the previous stream. There is a teacher who happens to be working as a maid girl in the evening. But you know what? Forget it. I want to go out again. I am mental. I keep changing my mind like that. Hey girls, what's up? Who's this guy? I'm so sorry I failed you, my love. I failed you, says your mother. Oh my son, you so paid us. Okay. Strip. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. What's she doing behind this? It's scary because they don't have a face. You know these NPCs because they don't have eyes. They look like, like you know, characters from uh, Japanese horror movies. You know, movies like The Ring and things like that. Look at that, super scary. Like she looks like a ghost. The fact that she fades away as well. That's super scary. Look, she appeared again. She's here to take my soul. While talking at the phone, as if it's normal. Okay, um, what's with the cinema? Nothing. Let's go somewhere. I'm gonna go there. Let's go to Shibuya. And let's go to work. Perhaps I can work at the. Let's go Station Square, perhaps there's something to do there. The Grudge, that's a good one, yeah, exactly. Oh, there is again that politician there. And there's a couple of guys here. Man, what gives? First the f up teacher, now bullshit con artists. Artists, societies suck. I can't take it anymore, man. I guess I'm gonna change the world myself, buddy. Bold. And just what do you hope to accomplish? Parting as hard as I can. Okay, well, that was just being stupid. Welcome to a lottery ticket. Welcome. Oh, I haven't played this before. So I can buy a ticket, it's 3000, and 10 random numbers for the year round Mad Month lottery. Should I try? Quite a lot of money, 3,000, but whatever. You never know. Thank you for your purchase. The result will be announced in a week. Buchiko statue. The faithful dog that waited for his master to the end. I'm so moved by his loyalty. 
This is an actual statue and a true story. But it's not called Buchiko, it's called Achiko. You can look it up. And there's a lot of information about it online. Everyone. Many of you suffer greatly from this distorted world of disparity. Please know that you can direct your criticism and outrage at me. I, Togonusaki Yoshida, will someday find a way to address your concerns in Nagatocho. Nagatacho, you, you, you're listening quite attentively. Are you interested in politics? I'm interested. Are you a student? I'm delighted to captivate the interest of someone your age. Ever seen you somewhere before? Oh, you were working at the beef bowl shop before. You have a lot of prefer perseverance for a young person. That's right. If you're interested, I could use your help. I want to change the state of this country and to do so, I need the power of the youth. However, due to certain regulation, I can't offer a job to a student. I was thinking you could learn some things if you chose to attend a few of my speeches, though. You know what, guys? Let's go with it. That would be helpful indeed. Well then, would you mind telling me your name and content information? Shuji Nakalami, huh? Nice to meet you. Toganosuke Yoshida. I used to be a member of the diet, but no longer. In the past 20 years, I've lost seven straight elections. It's quite a loser. This isn't good. I'm dwelling on the negative right before my speech. Well, I hope I can count on your help immediately. Cool, apparently all I need to do is to sort of hang out and learn from him. Oh, look, I'm holding a... <laughs> I'm holding a sign. With common sense, no longer our guide. We make decisions based on our selfish wants and desires. This has resulted in a delusion of self-centered people who delight in taking advantage of the weak. However, Big eyes, however, <laughs> even in this modern day and age, it is imperative that we act in the best interests of all. A world where it is acceptable to trample on the rights of others for your own benefit. A world where the young exist only to be exploited is a world that must be changed. The old woman is saying, easy for him to say, old timers like me have our hands full taking care of ourselves. He's actually making some good points, but he's a no name, he's probably won't get too far. Nothing's going to change, we'll just keep getting exploited. What's this wannabe politician blathering about? He isn't even affiliated with the party. How about you just leave matters of state in the capable hands of liberal corporate prosperity party? You must embase your decision on whom to support merely according to the party they belong to. That is so true, guys. I hope, this, I hope you're learning something from this game, because this game is always there to give you some lessons. Make sure, make sure you have your, your eyes peeled to the great teachings of this game. <laughs> Shut up already, you're just a washed up politician. If I'm chosen to represent the will of the people, then I am fully prepared to, in the best interest of all, ah, save the blathering for when you get elected, if you get elected. So he gets a lot of shit thrown at him. That's, that's the right way to put it. Thank you, this is all for today. Well, what did you think of my speech? The best interests of all? Well, the heckling. Let me let me actually point out to him that the best interests of all wasn't that positively as a line. Indeed, do you feel the same? No, no, you have to stop saying that stuff, man. There are times when the audience has a difference of opinion on a topic. Some feel I should concentrate on getting elected before I worry about others. Do you agree? You won't get elected? Yeah. I believe I can if my message connects with the audience. Besides, besides, I've grown quite accustomed to those type of reactions. No. I don't know if that is necessarily a good thing. Regardless, no matter what they say, I must continue on. I 
I think I can learn a lot by listening to Yoshida's speeches. Well then, I Perhaps I'll ask for your impressions again next time. Sometime, yeah, whatever. You know what, guys? I think that in this segment of the game, I should have learned something. Or I should have increased one of my stats. But based on the answers that I gave to this lunatic of a politician, I have learned nothing. Right? Yeah, I can also read only katakana and hiragana. I cannot read kanji. They still haven't called whoever sent the calling card. I started studying kanji, but <laughs> it's a long way to go before I can get any use to them. Like, it's hard to actually make use of them until you're really... Hot. You've really put some work under your belt, you know. Are we there yet? It's hard to breathe in here. Calling card and Madarama exhibit. The police are evaluating whether this is a true threat or a prank. Scam outbreak in Shibuya. Students are the primary victims. Organized crime is suspected here. Hey, hey. Students getting scammed? That's scary. Yeah, I also want to buy a book for getting to study kanjis. But you know what, the book will never study itself. You always have to put the effort in. What's this, a request to the student body? It says they're looking for information. All right, Principal Kobayakawa, put it up. Please consult the student council president if you have any details. Right? Why the student council president though? What does she have to do? What does she have to do with principal? Kobayakawa. Uh, I mean, Nijima-san is his favorite. Maybe that's why he asked her to do it. Hmm. That expression on his face. It seems like most of society was surprised about what that artist did. It was someone who represented Japan. They probably trusted him based on his name alone. Indeed, we're easily, easily manipulated by the names we see. However, this world is filled with fake names and jokes. For instance, this creature, which you know well, is called the Red King Crab. But he has a form that a crab should not have. Give it a try. What are Red King Crabs most biologically close to? I don't know. That looks like a crab to me. And why does... Why does he have two black legs? Is that just a shadow or... Shrimps, sunfish, hermit crabs, spiders. I would have gone with spiders. Shrimps? I mean... It has hard shells. Just like that. You know what? I can use the network. Hermit crabs? Like everybody says hermit crabs? I don't think that's correct. They look like spiders to me. No, they look like crabs, come on. They don't look like sunfish, they don't look like shrimp. Well, they do have a hard shell. Spiders, they're not sea animal. I don't know, I'm really... Hey, Misa, thanks a lot for stopping by and for watching. I will make this video available as usual on my YouTube playlist. 
And thanks a lot for stopping by. Have a good night and take good care of yourselves. Get better soon. So, thank you, chat. Now, let's go with Hermit Crab. This is it. <laughs> Not bad. Okay, I got it right. That's correct. Family. Pagura idea. Snow crab. Oregon die. So it's just the difference of number of legs. The direction the legs unfold is reversed too. Typically they face forward, but the rat kings do not. Oh that's true. No. Nice going. Alright. Incidentally, the tomale of crab is in its brain. It's actually the crab's liver and pancreas. As you can see, the world is full of deception. I saw some kind of paste like that in the fridge of Le at LeBlanc, but it's now often you see real crab meat. Hey, why don't we get sushi for our next celebration? Hey, we should, you know what, we should. I'm always up for sushi myself. Our name did spread a bit thanks to Madarame. But I bet people still wouldn't care if we came out and said we are the phantom thieves. You're right, nobody would care. I must agree. But what good would come of telling people our identities? Maybe they would at least start treating us with some respect. Oh my god, Ryuji, you're so selfish. It's shocking. Well, I can understand why you feel that way. That's just how things are now, but if we keep doing stuff like this, that will definitely change. We simply need to devote ourselves to the cause. Our praise will come later. What is that? I'm sure some people out there will understand. Huh, I guess we're just gonna act like modest heroes for now. Yeah, shut up, Ryuji. Seriously, shut up. Why do you have to be like the queen? Um. Male council member. Oh, you mean that guy? President, what is the meaning of that posting? Principal Kobayakawa put that up without my... We've already received some anonymous information. Hire some students are getting threatened. I'm so scared, please do something. <laughs> what? They have dared to me and they're demanding money. I can't go to the police, what should I do? Who's all those people? Isn't this talking about the crimes that have been rumored to be occurring in Shibuya? So there are even victims at our school, what should we do? Yeah, so the the crimes, these are sort of petty crimes that have been occurring and that we have heard about in the train before. Principal Kowayakawa called you in yesterday, right? Did he tell you anything about this? Um. It's out today, but I will ask him tomorrow. Just say so. Hey! 
If we keep this up, I'm sure we'll get more supporters. But first we need a new target. I hope we can find a good one. Some new info. Apparently there's a group of burglars terrorizing Shibuya. Burglars? From what I hear, they only target restaurants and break in after they close for the day. Someone online was asking if it was the work of the Phantom Thieves. Just reading that got me really pissed off. We can't let people lump you guys in with petty thieves, right? Just forget about it, don't do anything online. Hearing that just makes me makes it bother me even more. Anyway, I heard they've been running away without leaving even a trace of evidence. That's all the information I have on them right now, sorry. For now, I'll make a post on the fence and then ask for any more details people might know. Mm. Yeah, being famous really brings its own unique sets of problems. But we don't really have any info. We'll just have to wait for Mishima to get a more solid lead. Yep. What are you doing? Still hanging out in the hallway. I'll decide later. I'll still be in Shibuya for a little while, so let me know if, you know if anything comes up. Seems like Lady Anne hasn't gone home yet. I'm gonna decide later. You know what, let's spend time with her, why not? I need to push this further, but this is the rainy season. I really should do something like studying or something like that. As a matter of fact, I will put this on hold and go study. Because that's what you do on rainy days. Be a good student. And eavesdrop on conversations. Nothing to read. That is awful. Hmm? Okay, my knowledge and guts will increase if I study here. Hey, let's go. I need to buy another book to read. By the way, hey, don't worry about the noise around you. Just do your best to concentrate. Is that guy really going to sit down and study, even though he's a criminal with a record? He's more of a serious student than he looks. Don't stare at him. If your eyes meet, that guy's gonna kill you. <laughs> I love how dramatic to make it. Incredible. <laughs> perk up, perk up. Come on, give me some guts. All right. Nice. It seems that you were really focused on your studies. Alright. Wanna head back? Oh, I didn't get any special perks for the fact that it was raining. That is disappointing, really. Ah, you're back. Hey! I wonder if that Yoshida guy is giving a speech in Shibuya again today. Hey, you know what? I don't care about the Shibuya guy. Hey. One thing I'm gonna do though is to save. Okay. Let's save over this lot. Save complete. And I'm gonna use the phone and call the teacher who was being naughty naughty. The one that works as a maid. I should try calling the maid delivery service. Hold on, I don't have the guts to do it right now. Oh, you see? I don't think like I can call from LeBlanc, I have enough guts to be staunch. That's crazy. Then why don't I just study some more? Oh, you know what? I'm not gonna study, I'm gonna do something else. I'm gonna um, 
create some keys or something like that. Maybe give some something to the plant. Let's give it some energy. Nice. These are cheap, but it's far better than giving it nothing. Oh, my kindness has improved. That's good. I could either work on that or work on the desk. And I think I'd rather work on the desk now. What can I do? I really want to do lockpicks. Because the last time I was short on lockpicks and that ended up being uh, quite a lot of um, waste of time. I've just realized now that I can create other things. What's a vanish ball? Guarantees escape from battle. Raises chances of being targeted by foes for one ally. I've got more. Elude enemy pursuit by becoming temporarily undetectable. Oh, that's nice. Continue. I really need to do a lockpick. Okay. What are your thoughts? Hmm. You should be able to make one more. Fantastic. Let's continue. I'm gonna do another one of these things. Another lockpick. Surely I can find good use for it. What are your thoughts? You're definitely getting better. Yeah. Alright. More proficiency. Alright. Well then. Time to go to bed. There's a really fan site with a bunch of requests posted on it. <laughs> it's so cool! I can't believe there are real life superheroes. Are your social studies trip tomorrow? It's a good chance to think about your future.
question for me. With the advent of the color TV, something else started appearing in color. Do you know what it is? Color TV. Dreams. Underwear. It all makes sense though. It does make sense that people started dreaming in colors. Although that's stupid. And then underwear. Colored underwear. That does make sense. Pencils. Colored pencils. Oh man, I think it's either pencils or underwear. I'm gonna go with pencils just because I wanna be, you know, con conservationist. <laughs> conservative um but underwear makes sense let's see what the network says they say dreams but i find that stupid i'm gonna be part of the zero percent i swear i'm gonna do this i'm gonna be that zero percent and says underwear like that knowing for well that it's not right oh, okay there you go it is not right yeah dreams People's dreams were in black and white. This is this is incredible. This is incredible. I'm truly shocked. I don't believe it that people were so influenced by TV and uh, movies at the time, which were so primitive anyway. They used to be so simple. And yet, you know, people had their dreams taken as if they were a movie, which makes sense, but... Wait, does that mean that now... We dream in 4K. Yeah, that's the dream we dream in 4K. Does that mean we dream in 4K? Does that mean we dream in VR? Does that mean we dream in, you know, 3D? Whatever, man. I think this is a stupid, um, you know, completely um, unevidenced uh, opinion. This is just an opinion. This is unsubstantiated. I'll take a screenshot of this and ask your opinion on Twitter later. But research shows that once color broadcasts became the norm, most dreams started being in color. I can't believe it. I'm still skeptical. What's fascinating is that people see the world in color, regardless of TV's existence. If 3D televisions become normal and let us sense flavor, smell and heat, then dreams might become indistinguishable from reality. Yeah, so you see? So, you're wrong. This theory that our dreams is manufactured as if it was a movie is just not standing anywhere. That's incredible. I'm almost annoyed. I mean, I already, I already dream with flavors anyway. <laughs> Probably because of Mr. Kamoshida, right? Considering what happened with Suzui-san. Hmm? Hmm? I heard Principal Kobayakawa knew about the sexual harassment too and just turned a blind eye to it. I bet he wants to snuff out any rumors now. Even the volleyball team was told to keep quiet. Unbelievable. That's the worst. So that's what he's using Nijima Senpai for? Huh? Yeah, rumor has it she knew as well. Isn't that horrible? She acts so noble about it too. Nijima Senpai knew? <laughs> what is the meaning of this, Principal Kabayakawa? Why did you post the notice? It was all for your sake. I thought the more information you had, the easier your investigation would become. And 
did any information rise about the case I asked you to look into? <sighs> Nothing yet. I will pass the details along if anything comes up. Right now there is more there are more pressing issues. It appears there are students at Shujin who are being threatened to buy criminal organization. Hmm? Again, he gave that look again like he knew what's going on, like he is an accomplice. Hmm. A student who saw your posting came to us looking for help. I'd like to request a countermeasure. Uh, isn't this sort of isn't this some sort of mistake? I can't believe this would happen to the student of our academy. Now is no time for such problems. There is still lingering concern regarding the phantom thieves. No, but, but we received a request for help. I'm rather busy at the moment. If you wish to do something, you will need to act on your own. What? Are you sure about this? I'm still investigating your case as well. Yes, that's correct. It works out perfectly. My intentions have borne fruit. This criminal, uh, this criminal organization must be the connecting factor. If you pursue this criminal issue, you surely find clues about the phantom, the phantom thieves. But that's absurd. So, let's say this rumor is true. Do you intend to ignore those students in trouble? I... Your sister would have solved this easily if she were in your position. Oh, there you go. The principal is using the sister as a comparison to make her feel belittled. What a scumbag. The expectation of you are very high. I hope you don't disappoint. <laughs> pressure, pressure. Bigger target than Madarama, huh? I guess it would have to be someone who's the talk of the town. That is quite a vague prerequisite. Do we have any more specific ideas? Well, we do, because I have gone into the future. An evil overlord. Dude, this ain't some kind of video game. Either way, we we'll need to lead before we can begin anything. We'll just have to look for what for that as we go. If only there was a big target just laying around for us. What's with their anxiety over a performance, you know? Just relax. Enjoy your school lives. Hey! Tomorrow's field trip in the TV stations, isn't it? Maybe our next target will be a celebrity. You haven't forgotten about the target in Mementos, have you? We still haven't decided our next big target. I'd like to take care of the request. It could double the straining as well. If it's alright with you, would you like to go to Mementos? You know what? We should go to Mementos. We haven't been in a few days. So, I suppose so, yeah. Yeah, let's go. Hey, we're all here. You guys been checking the net? Things are getting pretty heated. Everyone is here. This is a good opportunity to sort through the mementos. Listen up. The intel is on a sadistic student. It sounds like she's been treating a particular male student as a slave against his will. For example, she will give him degrading orders or berate him in public. <sighs> so she's acting like a dominatrix to a guy who doesn't want that. That's horrible. I think we'll need to whip her heart instead, okay? Very well. Very well. I'll go along with this. No objections, right? We're good to go if you're okay with it. That's a unanimous decision. Okay, all that's left now is to take down the target mementos. Right, um, I don't want to do the sadism thing. I want to do this thing, part-time part job, full-time hell.
Let's infiltrate. Infiltrate palace? What's up? You know Mother Roma's palace isn't there anymore, right? Come on, let's hurry and figure out what our next target is. I was just trying to... I was just trying. Anyway, let's let's go. So now we have two targets. How does this work now that we have two targets? Yusuke is saying the number of targets residing within Mementos is two at present. Yeah, how do I tell apart which one is which? Because I know that there will be one at a certain floor downstairs, a certain underground level. Wait, you guys, something doesn't seem right. Really? It seems the same. Hold up. It looks like the nose reaching to something is reacting to something. Whoa. That's a whole new place to go there. A new area has been confirmed in the depths. Updating guidance information. What's this? It looks like the places we can go has expanded again. It's because we made Madarame's palace disappear, right? Most likely. You seem rather uncertain. How far does this Mementos run, anyway? Uh... It's huge! Extremely! Okay, so apparently this public palace is just almost endless. You're always so vague when it comes to the important stuff. It's like he's kind of flaky as our chief of operations. Don't you want him to try a bit harder too? You know what, Yuji? For once, I stand by you. He, that's correct. Totally, man. You've got some nerve, you two. There, there. I don't fully understand, but mementos and the palaces are related to each other, correct? Then all we must do is continue changing the hearts of evildoers to ascertain its full expanse. That's correct. I don't believe there's a need to quarrel over it. Right, so speaking of my team, Kyuji's out, and that's the way it should be. Let's go. Well then. Start pathway in. Area seven. I don't know if it's seven is a good point, but. Oh. There, that's the shell of that girl named Shimuzu. Uh, she really seems like a sadist. She's calling someone a slave and running him around. In a way, she's denying his existence. I certainly wouldn't want to be a victim of that. Let's go talk to her. Wait, wait, wait. I need to... I need to save, don't I? Wait, wait. I forgot to save. Wait, wait, let me back paddle to the entrance. Sorry, but this is quite important that I say. Because considering my luck, I would probably just go up there, start a fight and be killed in a, in a single move. Let's go now. Well then. Let's go straight to a... Oh! Uh, scary. Let's go. I should have known. Yeah. <laughs> so you're the pigs who wrote that calling card online. Why do I deserve this? <laughs> it's because you made some guy your slave. That's all kinds of wrong right there. That's what he wants. He worships me more than any god, you know. Uh... Oh, I don't know where to begin to explain how you're wrong. I beat him and I hurt him and he sees it as a sign of our love and friendship. He's so happy. Hold a moment. You're delusional. Um, it's all I'm pretty. I'm a creator good. 
It's my right to order people around. You know what? She's not wrong. She's she's right. But nonetheless. Cool enemy. She looks cool. It seems that she will be... I don't know if she'll be more strong in physical attacks or magical attacks. We'll have to see. I'll never give up. I'll never give up Amamoto. Amamoto is the name of the guy. He belongs to me. Being my slave is what makes him happy. Well, you know, I agree with something. In life, I've learned that it doesn't matter how much you hurt somebody. You only lose them when you disappoint them, not when you hurt them. You're welcome for this. Video. I don't see a You're welcome. Come. Let's try with electricity. There. Thank you. Oh, that's a big help. Well, yeah, I am down. It's getting too reckless. I'm trying all possible attacks. Oh, weak to fire. Excellent. The best panther. Let me try with physical attacks. No, let me try with. Let me try decreasing her attack. All right. Good thing I decreased it. Right, physical attack doesn't really do much to her. Let's go. Let me try anyway. Let me try with sleep. Ah, oh, missed it. Critical, that's good. I need to cure the rage state because otherwise we'll focus on physical attacks. That's not, not that is not very good. Anything that cures rage. Oh man, I don't have anything that cures rage. No, I don't have anything like that, so it seems that all I can do is to keep attacking on the physical side. Oh, I recovered. Let's go. Oh no, she's charging. I need to kill her fast. That's done! Easy peasy. 12,000. And level up! Hey guys, I'm level 20. I'm kind of a big deal. Power courses through me! Awesome. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure to follow the channel for support. Leave me a thumbs up, that will make me happy. Fantastic. Let's see if I can catch this the other the other boss as well, the other request. No, 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 I don't want to lose him, he's mine. Why don't you ask him? Oh, I'm scared, I don't want to ask him. Why don't you start treating him like that? No, sorry, why did you start treating him like that? Oh, what was I doing? He just kept going along with it. So I misunderstood and thought I could do anything I wanted. 
Actually, I wanted to be more than friends with him. Huh? More than friends? I had a crash on him, but then I got possessive. Those feelings went out of control. Well, fair enough. Yeah. Okay. Be careful that you don't make things worse for yourself. The treasure. Whip sword, okay. Cool, let's see if I can go through here now. Yeah. This is because more people believe in us now. Exactly, our popularity has raised and it seems that the public perception has changed, so... Yeah, I think we can keep going. Alright, we have this new area. Doesn't this look different from how it was before? Looks like it'll be a new area from here on. It's quite a marvel to find a subway system down here. Her to Yusuke, it's always been like that. I can sense our target somewhere in this area. Let's cover this floor for them. Okay, it seems that we are on the same target. <sighs> Sorry, on the same level as the target. We cannot save. Which I don't like, but hey, fair enough. An enemy! Fuck! That's not ideal. New enemies. So what? Not a good way to start the fight. Let's go! Let's see. Let's go with Zio. Go down! Ooh, look at that. He almost killed me completely. Lose. I appreciate it. Oh, that's a big help. Let's go. Let's try. Let's do this. Maybe the crisis attack. That's the least I can do. Ooh. Damn. What's this? Moderate HP recover to one ally. I need to use this. Hi, Pixie. All right. Thank you. What was that? Ooh. This is my other self! No weaknesses I can see. I'll put you down! Persona! Let's try with fire. Ah, oh, resistive to that. Ooh, good thing I missed. Persona! Let's keep going this way. I want to equip him. He's strong. Let's go with this. Awesome. All right. One enemy remaining. This is the last one. Let's try with wind. No. Wind. He's repellent as wind. Okay, it's a good thing we find out. Let's try with ice now. Go on. Oh, it's weak to it. I knew you could do it, Fox. You bastard! What are we making me do? I don't want. I don't want that. I want your attack. Persona, go in, on. Strike. That hit its weak point. Keep it going, Fox. Fantastic. Okay, good. Great. Yeah! Victory! Welcome to the stream, guys. Thanks for the thumbs up and the support. One thing I want to do now that I survived okay. this kind of difficult match. 
Let's go, Joker. Is to save, really. Okay, one less match and then I'll go back to the main entrance to save. Oh, we know is weak to ice, so let's try and give him a good beating. No sudden move. All out. Finish What? No. Let's heal. Need the healing. Much thanks. Thank you. I am thou. Let's go. Let's go with the physical attack. No more one should do. There you go. Keep it going, Fox. You can't do this. Oh, he wants to talk. Then lend me your power. Yeah. Thanks for, spare, for sparing me, hey? I can't believe it, I remember now. I am I'm no shadow from this place. I used to be believing in that there, in the sea, sea of human soul. From now on, call me Ippon the Tar. No need for honorifics, Sonny. Fan fantastic, guys, we got a new persona. Your power is incredible, Joker! Great. I'm happy with that. Okay. You know what? I need to... I need to return to where I was before. And... I wanna try and, and save. You know what I mean? From here, I can go to our area, and then perhaps... From here, I can go to Mementos of a View, the entrance, and save. I'll just add this. And now I can take care of the other fight. Skill. There. Give myself a bit of healing and let's take care of our... here but I can't sense any target. Wanna move to another area? Yep, we're going down. I can sense our target somewhere in this area. I know. It's time to go. One day if we will catch him. Anytime I go back to a floor the uh, the the path will change, so the map of the floor will change. No, no, why did I do that? I stood I not where I wanted. I pressed X by mistake. Let's restart again. So you will see that this will change. This will have changed now. So you see the map already looks a bit different. Oh, he's coming this way. Let's go all out. 
or maybe go for an item. It's a rare item. This is what you wanted, right? Revival bead. Okay, that's a good item. Let's pull back. For that's now. fine. We got a revival bead. It's a fairly good item to get. All right. Okay. What now? Let's try to go straight. I can see the question mark. You see, it's over there. So we should turn right and find our enemy here. There you go. I can sense the target up ahead. Do you want to head in? Let's do it. Welcome to the stream, guys. There he is. It's Sodo, the shop manager. With an unpleasant smile. It says customer service smile, right? Yet behind the scenes he's extorting his subordinates. This guy must start doing it to his con to his customers too. Who knows? Huh? That would be a disaster. Let's go. Am I ready for a fight? Yeah, whatever. I'm ready. Welcome, welcome. How may I help you, ladies and gents of the Phantom Thieves? Why do you blackmail your own employees? That's not normal. My shop is a direct is directly managed store of a large chain. Since I'm highly competent, I'm in charge. I don't need strangers complaining about how I use the shop's money. Part-time work is at the property of the shop. Whoa, that's wow. That doesn't fly, not even in Japan. What? Property? Who do you think you are? I get it now. You pretend to be heroes, but all you are is just criminals. I'm gonna kill ya! <laughs> Typical battle cry. I like his costume. So, as usual. Let's try to find his weakness. Outlaws would are trespass in my sanctuary. Prepare to be royally obliterated by my hand. Okay, it seems that he's really focused on physical attacks. I need to heal myself though. No, not even that. I need to use an item here, something strong. Anything I can take to recover 100%? No? I'm gonna use this on myself. Recovers HP but lowers my attack. Doesn't matter. I always use Morgana for recovery anyway. I am thou. Let's try ice. I don't see a weakness. <laughs> Now let's try fire. Or even let's decrease his attack because that's important. Hey! Attack down, okay. Persona! And they seems to be strong on physical attacks, so I'm gonna change for the other persona, Shisa, which is strong on physical attacks. Shisa! Let's see. Medium chance of confuse. Let's try. Now. Always oh, confused, that's good. Throw away devil fruit. Let's try um, wind magic, you never know. Persona. Let's try ice. Take this. Let's try fire. I don't see a weakness. Persona! Calm down. You're mine. Hmm, he resists physical attack. It's still confused, that's good. Persona! 
I'm gonna keep going with the wind attack. This is my other self. I don't see a weakness. Yeah, I'll keep going with that attack. I'm gonna try and give him a high chance of sleep, because you never know. How about this? No, I missed. Should have done that. Let's see what else I can do. Oh, this this character, I haven't checked him out yet. He has light jammer. He resists dizzy, which is good. Hmm, I don't know. It seems that the best option I have here is to keep going with the current one. Tell you what. I'm gonna switch to Shisa and use um, Zio. Just because we haven't used Zio yet. Go down! Come on, we're almost there. Your agility is lower. Die. Almost. Oh, he's frozen. Look at him. He's totally frozen. I don't see a weakness. Let's try to do this. Technical. I'm doing so little damage on him. It's ridiculous. Let's go with Zero again. There. Almost. Oh shit. No. Die, goddammit, die. Missed. How dignified. Come on, dude, don't die now. Oh, just. Just. Did you see that? Oof. Whoa. Almost. Almost dead. I had Yusuke and Morgana almost like one step away from being dead. And they're level 20. All good. Really glad I didn't lose their experience point by dying. <laughs> <laughs> cool, Mabufu, that's really good. I like that. Well done, Yusuke. I'm sorry. Am I really not worthy of being the store manager? That's right. I knew it. I remember now, employees are in property. They're human beings. And yet I took advantage of them, I've done bad things. Talk about a horrible workplace. I don't know how I can ever make up for this. You've done quite a bit more, haven't you? It'd be best if you just confess everything. I don't know, this game is all about going around and making people feel sh like shit. But it's what's, you know. That's what needs to happen sometimes. Okay, I got the trophy, guys. Aren't those Chinese desserts or something? I see, so he was lining his own pockets. Cool. <laughs> that went well, what should we do? Keep exploring? No, let's go back, we've done our jobs for today. We actually completed two boss two bosses in a single exploration that's really good but I want to go to the velvet room because now I'm level 20 and I should be able to you know cook up a nice persona Dean. sorry for using the term cook up that's <clears throat> that's fine one thing that I really want to do is to hey by the way didn't the twin wardens wanted yeah. something we are looking for a Shisa that has the skill Frey. Okay, I have Shisa, but I don't have Frey. Let's go talk to Igor. First thing I want to do is to 
is to register my personas. The compendium you want to register? Talking about Barrett though, I don't know if I should register him. Because the current status is level 9 and the one I registered is level is um, is 11. So I don't want to register this. And Jack Frost instead. Yeah, this one I can register. So this one and this one. Are you sure? All of the all of the current lists are elected. Yes, go ahead. And this one I don't want to register. Now, Barrett, as I said, is not particularly good. I would like to use it. Let's go fuse Barry's hold, and let's try to find by level. Let's try to find something that uses Barrett. There you go, this one uses Barrett, but I will need to sacrifice Shisa, which I don't want to do. Plus, this is level 23, so I can't even do it. But I could create new... I see. A strong this guy. Indeed. No, I don't care about him. It's not even that strong. What about Liana Sida here? You okay with this? She is hot. So for doing this, I will need to sacrifice Jack Frost and Ipon Datar. I don't feel like sacrificing him very much. And Jack Frost is a convenient one to have. But this won't be cool because she has a psych damage, medium psych damage to one foe. That's cool. Effective versus mental ailments. Hmm. She's physically very weak though. Nonetheless, a good one to have. But I don't feel like sacrificing Ippon Datar yet. Or this too. I tell you what. I'm gonna do a fusion the old style. I'm gonna make mix Barret and Bradget. Not terrible, but not I'm gonna have this guy which I never had before. About Regent, uh, technically, technically he is cool, but I never get to use him. For some reason, you cannot use this guy in in boss fights. Like in the boss fights, it doesn't show up. You you're not allowed to use him. So I'm like, whatever. I'm sure we will find something better, right? Not really, but. Oh man, I just want to get rid of Barrett's mouth. What if I do a, an advanced fusion with... Oh, no, I can't do much. Fusion. Tell you what, I'm not gonna fuse anything for now. I'm gonna keep Barret though, I'm not gonna use him. And that's gonna be it. Because I'm happy with my personas. I don't wanna reduce the variety of personas that I have. I like the current variety and variety is very important in this game. Let's go back to this cool life and let's save and call it a night. In the meantime, I thank you already for hanging out with me. I will make this video available. Oh, look at Ryuji all alone, left alone by itself. That's because I don't like you, Ryuji. Anyway, let's head back. Cool. Defeated quite a few guys. Well, a couple of them. And I've reached this new section. That's nice. Ah, you're back. You know we're going to to that TV station tomorrow, yeah? I'm thinking we might find our next target there. Oh, that's right. You always hear about how celebrities are involved in all sorts of shitty business. You're absolutely right. With that much money, they've probably got their fingers in all sorts of dirty businesses. Phrasing has quite the more ring to it. 
dude, you always react to the weirdest stuff. <laughs> anyway, we got to observe the live recording of a show, right? Oh, maybe we're gonna be on TV. We'll just be in the crowd, remember? Any TV appearance will be for like two seconds. Mm, try not to pull any fanciful with stunts to garner attention, okay? <laughs> That'll be cool. I can't study, I suppose. Oh, people, let's talk to them. Have you been getting a lot of spam mail lately? Hardly getting my information. Do you remember the cyber attacks? Tens of thousands of people's personal information was leaked. Alright, I heard about those hackers. I hate they've been causing damage around the world. They act like they're fighting an unjust system, but there's still a problem to people like us. Thank you, the curry was delicious. That was... that was weird. That was a weird way to finish the conversation. Anyway, on Discovery Town Detectives, we talk about Motomachi Chinatown, a popular attraction for foodies. So many Chinese restaurants. Yes, high quality Chinese food is true perfection. Good smells are coming from all over this place. It's easy to find something great to eat here. Okay. Hey. Okay, I can't do much it seems. Hey. So, before I go to sleep, I'll do something very important, which is saving. The never forgotten heart of saving. Thank you very much guys for hanging out with me. I shall say good night now. It's been a pleasure as usual. I will be streaming again. This video will be part of my of a playlist on my YouTube channel. And thanks a lot guys for hanging out with me. I wish you all a good night. I will see you again soon in the next few days. And I wish you all a good weekend. Take care. I'll see you guys in the next video. Good night guys. Thanks a lot.